Hey Halians, I'm Nico and I'm a Breath of the Wild material collector. I'm looking to get a pure 100% game, and if you're like me, you want to get all the materials too. Today, we'll quickly learn where to get hardy blue shell snails and sneaky river snails, but also a few other materials to make your collecting journey efficient and convenient. I hope this is helpful, if you like it, give it a thumbs up, and if you want more Zelda content, I hope you consider subscribing or at least checking out the channel. Both snails are a little hard to see. You can find them almost anywhere in shallow waters and today we'll learn why you need them and where I like to farm them. Hardy blue shell snails are needed for the what's for dinner side quest. Talk to Kiana in Lurlin and she'll ask for some goat butter and a hardy blue shell snail. Besides that, you can cook them. Each cooked one will give you full health and three additional temporary hearts. <laughs> you can get them at any beach like Lurlin, just turn on Yushika sensor to farm them. Lately, I've been going to Lanayru Bay. I start at the shrine, then make my way around. You will get a few crabs here. Some porgy. Some octorox here for the rare eyeballs. There's also a lionel here. And when you go down here, there's some crabs and a couple groups of sparrows for some chikaloo nuts. Then I cross the bay and grab a few more snails. Now for sneaky river snails, they do give low stealth when cooked, but you need 15 to upgrade your Sheikah gear to level 3. Like I mentioned earlier, you can get them randomly in shadow waters, like Thunder Plateau, but there's one place they always respawn. Usually I go to this shrine, jump across the river to the Dea Lake, sit until night so I can see them better, and there's 5 in this well, and another 5 in this well. And sometimes you'll find a random one or two crawling around. Then I travel down to Farouche Hills, and you can get about 10 of them here. There's also some sunset fireflies and blue nightshades. That's how I collect snails. I hope you're having a relaxing farming journey. I hope this short video was helpful, and if you want more Zelda content, I hope you subscribe or at least check out the channel. See you next time!